Hey guys, Pixel here, and welcome back to an episode of Minecraft Chronicles. Now, in the last episode, we did make our whole, like, uh, dinosaur enclosure slash pen slash cage thing in the start to the entire dino world park thing. And also, as you guys know, today is a SMS, which means one hour of unedited raw video footage. And also, before we start this, I just want to show you something. So, this is our crafting room, obviously. Um, if we walk upstairs, there's this room in which we have nothing happening yet. We walk upstairs, there's nothing here, nothing here. There's the bunny room, there's my bedroom, and then there is, uh, you know, the bedrooms over here, whatever that stuff is. There's the first floor and everything down here. Then there's the very top, like, the, the very top of the house, the rooftop garden. And you know what all these places have in common? None of them. Not one has Sean or Shauna, whatever her name is. You know, the lady that the matchmaker, aka me, set us up with. Yeah, well, she ran away or she's dead or missing or something. And I realized Thorgy's gone. I did find Thorgy running around trying to find um, both of them. Thorgy is like somewhere around here, I think so. Something like, th oh, here he is. Hey, Thorgy. Thorgy, can you, okay, uh, follow me. Uh, but yeah, so I don't know where she went. I don't know if she's died. I don't know if she died or she's dead or the same thing, but I don't know if she's still alive, or if she just left, or, you know, she's, like, still somewhere around here, because you can look on the map, and it does come up as, like, one of these little white cursor arrow point things, these are the four bunnies, this is Thorgy, this is me, and then over here, we have all the chickens, uh, my horse, and then the sheep, and then the cows are over here, and I cannot find her, she's not in Dinoland, she's not anywhere, and I don't know why. So, she may have left us, she may have died, and I kind of think she may have died because normally when it turns nighttime, they're supposed to teleport back to their room, but for some reason, I don't really think that was working because she wasn't teleporting back to her room to sleep anyways, so I'm not really too sure. She may have gone outside and got, like, stuck on one of the fences and, like, a skeleton was shooting at her and she couldn't attack it because honestly, I don't remember if- I know she's a guard, but I don't remember if she's a guard who has a sword or a bow, I don't know. But also, I did, um, I, was, I organized my inventory and all the chests and everything downstairs as, been, as I've been saying that I wanted to do. And actually, these are normal music discs, and these are supposed to go in here. So I made another one of these music discs racks. Um, oh my god, we have five of the same one. That's really strange, and I don't even like these ones. But, um, so yeah, we have another music disc rack, so it's like normal wrist, normal music discs, and then like the whole fossil archaeology ones and then we have all of our dna stuff in here i just organized this a whole lot more and i found a tablet in this chest and i put it up on the wall so i'm thinking what we're going to do i definitely want to hatch our i definitely oh i'm like why is it not going i definitely actually don't want to do that i definitely want to hatch our triceratops today so let's get this little egg out and then let's also get um these shells the whole like hen dish and the trianosaurus um, because I do want to try to get the DNA from those shells, but they have to actually be in there for anything to actually happen. And so we have 16 biofossils there, so we can hatch another, well, we can turn another DNA into an egg if we needed to. How many biofossils? Oh, is that all of them? We have 60 biofossils, actually, plus the ones in here, we have what? Like 76? Yeah, 76, about bones. Oh, great. We didn't get, we didn't get any DNA from that. That was ridiculous, but... I mean, things don't always go well in these whole, like, scientific process stuff. Also, I do know someone, someone told me, where is it? These things, the ancient fern spores. These, apparently, you can grow under trees. Is there any more here? No, there's not. But these you can grow under trees, and um, it basically makes, like, actual fern things, like fern bushes that the, um, the, you know, like, herbivores and stuff can eat. And also... I didn't, I, oh, one thing, I wanted to wait to check out what this thing actually is, so we have this mysterious figure that we got from, I believe, a chest or something like that, in the, in a couple videos ago, I just wanna, oh, that is creepy, it, it's a mysterious figurine, but it's like a, a full one compared to these ones, but it's like really broken up looking, I'm just gonna leave that, it's kinda scary looking, but, um, so yeah, I, I decorated and finished making the Triceratops, uh, kind of like cage thing in between videos and I definitely wanted to uh, do that in off camera because I thought that'd be a little bit boring to just have two full episodes and like half of a SMS you know like a Super Minecraft Saturday special thing to just be building so this is what it 
What was that? I think that was a bird, but it was a scary bird noise. Um, oh, there's a fox under there. But yeah, so this is what it looks like. We have like, a little area here you can look in. I, I made some glowstone and I put them under the fences and stuff so, to light it up. And then I placed a whole bunch of leaves around here, but I positioned them so that the, uh, the Triceratops could not jump on top of them and just like escape or anything like that. And also I put a lot in there because I do know that the Triceratops will actually eat the leaves. And then I just have like a whole bunch of greenery and some grass and stuff. And then we have like a little den over here and have some water. And then this door is going to be like a employee's only door which is how we get into the actual tricer uh, triceratops habitat so we'll have like an employees only sign or something over here because this hole in the cage is not going to be here forever and if it was the dinosaur would just escape and that doesn't really work and then these holes up here i'm thinking we're gonna fill with glass or something like that so it's like you can see in from the second story because up there is going to be a whole like walk around area so let's just plant our triceratops egg down like right I guess like right here. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, oh, thank God. I thought I killed it. That scared me. Oh, I can pick up back up like that too. Okay, that's cool. So I don't exactly know how long this takes hatches, but I do know that I have to be in the vicinity for it to hatch. So let's just place some of these fern spores. It has to be under trees, I believe. So yeah, let's just place the stuff around here. Let's remove some of this stuff so we can actually like grow underneath the trees. And I think they do actually spread. So I don't think we're going to need to place a whole bunch. So, let's just place one, like, right here. Oh, no, I'm out. What if I... Oh, no. Oh, no, I've done goofed. I made a big mistake. Because if I left that go, we probably could have gotten... We probably could have placed those in, like, other cages or something like that. But, oh, they're already growing. I probably can pick them up with shears or something. But I don't have any shears on me. And I kind of want to waste the iron right now. And also, I don't have the iron on me. So, you know what? Just in case, because I don't want to, I don't want the Triceratops to hatch without us, because then we don't, like, own the thing, and then it'll just, like, die or leave us or something like that. So let's head over to the quarry, get some, oh, get some iron, see how this thing's working. Oh, the red. What's the heat? Um, I'm just gonna type a bunch, oh, that's a lot of heat. Um, I need buckets, I need buckets, I need to cool this down. Do we not have any buckets? Oh, dear God, oh, God, oh, God. Topaz, we haven't found that. There's a whole lot of stuff in here. How far is this digging down? Oh my god, we've already gone to bedrock. Oh, oh, it didn't it didn't actually remove everything there because there's the pots, but that's actually really, really good. Um, so let's take this iron, let's make a little furnace, and let's smelt this because I do not want this and what am I doing? I do not want this engine to like explode or blow up or whatever, because that's gonna ruin everything here. And I don't know exactly how big the blast radius is, so it could destroy this entire island. Like, if possible, probably. I don't really know, but honestly, I don't really want to find out. So, let's just put this stuff in there. And where's the other ore? Oh, here it is. Um, how did it end up back there? I don't know. Very curious and per peculiar. Can't talk right. So, let's put coal in there. Um, and you know what? That barely made this any actual fuel. So, let's just put, like, um, some coal in there. Because the coal really uh, lasts a long time. And it last forever pretty much and that's just gonna make us a whole lot of fuel and then we can always um add some more oil and stuff because there's a lot of oil over there but the thing is is i need this iron really quickly because i don't actually what am i doing so i'm smelting the iron and wasting it i can just go back to the house run down to our little storage room over here and uh get the buckets you know oh also so i was looking here i made this chest the whole like the inventory pets chest then obviously we have the buildcraft chest, and I realized we're out of chests, so where do we put like miscellaneous items or anything like that, or if we need more? So I put two chests up there, these don't have anything in them, and they're not labeled yet, well the, like the, the labels are on them, it's just there's not anything in the labels. So we can use those for whatever we need to when that time comes. Only problem is, I still feel really bad, because I don't know, I don't know where, um, where what's her face, like Sean or Shauna is, whatever her name is. And I, and I feel really bad about that, I do. But I don't know if she left me or she's dead. If she's dead, I can't bring her back. If she left me, well, if she left me, then she left me. You know, not my fault. Technically, we weren't together or anything. It was just like a test run. So we may have to go check back the village. Maybe she's there. I didn't check there. And maybe, uh, like, you know, maybe she missed her family or something like that. Or or, or maybe she just, she left. Um, She left to, oh, don't eat me. But if you attack me, I'm going to kill you. Let's just fill this cake backpack up with uh water but i want to see something um but as i was saying if i if she left me maybe she just went on vacation or something didn't forgot to leave a note or something like that i don't really know but i want to see if i break that away 
place that there. Will it actually go in? No, it will not. Okay, well, that's a little annoying. It means I have to do everything by hand, but, you know, it's fine. I'm not going to be lazy about this. It does save a whole lot of time for me having to, instead of, like, me having to actually um, bucket up the, all the water myself, I can just put it into the tank. So it definitely saves time in the long run. It's just kind of a little annoying, and I hate, I really do hate how you cannot transport the tanks and put them in your inventory without them losing all the fluids. I mean, it does make sense. It really does, I'm not gonna lie, but I hate it. I think that should contain the fluids, so it's like you can just break it and it will keep it. And you know what? There are more stuff here, so maybe she's like around here somewhere. I don't really know. I really hope she's not dead. If she is, that's me really, really sad. Um, I hate that, how I keep just falling down there. Is she around here? Because I did see some kind of entity. Or is that Billy Goat? No, that's just the duck. I wonder what happened to Billy Goat. Um, or I guess his name is actually just Billy, but still, who cares? Um, so let's take those buckets in there, and then let's just put them in there to cool the stuff off. And I mean, I guess we kind of just wasted that water because this thing isn't working anymore. Well, it's not that it's not working. It's just we're out of actual stuff to have it going. But, you know, I'm thinking that's going to keep going, so... Originally, what I wanted to do in today's episode is I wanted to, um, I wanted to hatch our dinosaur, so we're definitely go going to go and do that, but because of the reason that this isn't working anymore, I think we're just going to leave this area, and I'll either move it out of video, or, like, we'll focus next episode or something like that on it, but I do just want, maybe she's down by the lake, I don't know, but I really just do just want to check the village once again and see... That hopefully she's there because I really hope that she's not dead. You know, we're talking a lot. We really like each other's company. And that's just a raccoon. Stupid raccoon. But, um, so let's just check the village. She's not. Maybe the matchmaker, a.k.a. me. Um, is it, should I say a.k.a. or slash? I think it's just say slash. The matchmaker slash me. Um, you know, we can set us up with someone else or something like that. You know. So, oh, I feel like this thing's grown, but the village looks exactly the same, but I do feel like it's just a little bit bigger. I don't know. I think I'm just going crazy. And is this, this lady's poor, is still stuck in her poor, poor house. Let's just break that door for you. Oh my God, it scared me. Um, okay, so let's just try to find someone. Hello? Okay, everyone is married here. Um, uh, I didn't mean to click on you. Twana. You are the other lady who looked exactly like, but you're greedy. I think, I think Shauna was greedy too. Wait. You're not the same person, okay? I was gonna say, because maybe, I think she may have just changed her name or something like that. She was like this, but this is, uh, Sierra. Or however you pronounce her name. So, hmm, I don't really, oh, is it you? No, that's, those are two. Okay, nope, never mind. Um, sorry to disturb you. Is there anyone in here? There's a whole lot of people in here. Is it you? Oh, that's Portia. And you're married. Um, okay. Well, it seems like she's not here. So I have to assume, I have to assume the worst that she is dead. And I have to assume that either she's dead or she left us or what, but I don't really know. So, we may make a grave and leave her, like, put a little grave in the grave area. Like, the graveyard for her, I don't really know. But, let's just head back home. Actually, we have, and no, we don't have the backpack anymore. Let's just, where is it? Dino Park. Let's just teleport to the Dino Park, leave the egg here, and then we'll run over to the house, sleep really quickly, and I think it should be fine. Uh, I don't have any fences on me, so we're definitely going to have to do that. So let's just teleport back to the house, because I don't want that thing hatching without me. And I don't know how long it's going to hatch, so we may work on the on the little cage there. Not cage, sorry, enclosure. Yes, a closure, definitely enclosure. But we may work on that little enclosure there, um, or something like that. So let's just run back over here. Um, where? Oh, right, I'm, I'm going crazy. I'm like, where's the fences? They're in the chest, obviously. Also, I, I looked, we have a decent amount of stairs here, but then you look at the, the slabs. We have so many half slabs that we're never going to use. I don't even know why they're in there to begin with. Uh, let's get the grave, because we can do that later, um, and then the fences. And you know what? Maybe, maybe she's at the dino park. Maybe she wanted to see the little enclosure or something like that, or maybe she wanted to see the new areas that we were building. So let's just look on the map. Um, doesn't look like it. No. Well, if she ever does come back and if she is still alive, hopefully she is. I, I probably should have pressed, like, stay, or, is that a, oh no, not a fool. 
not a oh it's an ancient fern strange but it's not a full block but they are spreading um okay so here's the thing i don't know if she's still alive i probably should have pressed stay so she wouldn't move and walk around the place but i didn't want to i didn't want her to feel like she was trapped or anything like that so and i still kind of feel like i made a little bit of a mistake but you know it's fine um we could have our grave not in here but like somewhere around here so it's like by the house so we have like our own graveyard i don't really know but let's just we don't really um uh, we don't really have anything to set up here so let's just search in the whole fossil archaeology mod for a little bit see what this mod has more to offer um raw chicken cooked chicken soup oh this gives us okay so the essence chicken yeah you feed this to your dinosaurs make them grow and it gives you yeah it gives you like eight so this stuff it, i know it doesn't work on all dinosaurs but i think it does work on triceratops so i'm thinking this may be a good idea so cooked chicken is raw chicken soup and it's just raw chicken in a bucket that is extremely easy so let's just teleport to the uh house and let's go actually i think we may have some raw chicken in the in the fridge uh raw chicken yes let's just make one um and then what else we need we need a, a bucket i only have buckets of milk i mean i guess we can just drink a bucket not a huge deal um drink that and put actually i need the bucket very strange noise um oh i'm gonna take this with me and then you know what i'm gonna take the furnace over there because i don't want the thing hatching without me and then oh also let's get our dinopedia from the second floor oh and also eight i think it was eight glass bottles that we needed and if we i don't think we have eight i know we have a decent amount but oh we can put this um frozen meat in the analyzer and hopefully get some prehistoric dna from that um like like i really want a mammoth I really do want a mammoth. They are so cute in the fossil archaeology mod. And also, I want a mammoth from both the fossil archae- Oh, we only have three. But we can make those easily. Um, kind of rhymes. But I want a mammoth from both the fossil archaeology mod and from the- Is the egg still there? Oh my god, what was that? Oh my god, it's alive. That scared me. I'm like, I don't, I don't see the egg. But I do see it there. Is it tamed then? Because I did kind of leave when it hatched. Um... Hello, dinosaur. I think it's tamed. I think it's ours. <gasps> oh my god. That is loud. I'm just gonna lower the volume just a tiny bit. Um, freaking, oh my god. Lower the volume on that. Uh, what would it be? I guess hostile? Friendly? I don't really know. I don't think he's attacking us. I don't think he'd be hostile. Um, okay, so let's just set up a little furnace over here so we can craft this thing. But as I was saying, I want a mammoth from both the um fossil archaeology mod what was i looking for i'm going crazy more um i want a say not a sandwich i want a um i want a mammoth sorry from both the fossil archaeology mod and the oh shut up god oh i left all my coal back at the other place i can just put some fences in there um but i left i'm like where'd the fences go once again i have to get through this so I left the, um, not I left, I want a mammoth from both the Fossil Archaeology mod and the Mo Creatures mod. The only difference is, is the Fossil Archaeology mod you have to cultivate, and then the Mo Creatures mod, Tar, what in the world? But the Mo Creatures mod, you just, it's just basically a elephant that is found in snowy areas, so it's not really, like, a difficult thing to do, you know? So, we're definitely going to have to... Where's the backpack? We're definitely going to have to do that sometime soon. Did I not pick up the bat backpack? That's such a tongue tire. Bat backpack. But you can't say that five times fast. Well, actually, let's try. Bat backpack. Bat, bat, bat. It sounds like I'm saying bad backpack. And it just, like, mixes the words together. So, you know what? I don't have my... I don't have the backpack pack. And I would rather not despawn. Is it just not... Oh, yeah. I didn't pick it up really weird but um okay so we need to make some more glass bottles so let's make a whole bunch and i don't know if it gives you the glass bottles back it should do but i'm not too sure about that um oh it did not okay that's kind of fine anyways um essence of the chicken the chicken oh oh dang it okay so he's eating he's actually eating the leaves and stuff or in, like the ancient ferns but i do know that we need like a feeder or something like that just in case he's not eating that so the feeder and saying reinforced glass what in the world um time machine oh, i forgot about that stuff there's so much stuff here this is crazy um okay uh feeder feeder oh stone iron glass bucket so much stuff so that's actually just my stone do we have stone on us no we do not we have the glass 
We have the bucket. We can make a button really easily. We just need stone. Stone would be in the miscellaneous chest. Stone. I think that's everything that we actually need. Okay, so let's just teleport back. Actually, no. Let's, let's, can, I wonder if he can eat this kind of stuff. Let's just give him some grass or, and some leaves possibly. You know, let's just um, put some leaves and maybe he'll eat saplings too. I don't really know. But let's just take that stuff. And then put them in like the feeder and i'm thinking the feeder should actually be back here not like in the main public area we could give him melons we do have a melon farm and as granted it's not much but we're never going to use melons so you know that's kind of fine uh let's just put it like right here for right now we can always move that that's a furnace wrong item but we can always i didn't even craft it i'm an idiot but we can always move it um when we need to so backpack I'm just gonna say bat pack, like instead of bat bat pack, just bat pack. Bat pack to the rescue! So, oh, oh, in this version, I think you actually need stone. Yep, because it's a stone button. A little strange, but it's fine. Um, so, was, oh my god, stop for a second. Oh, I forgot the iron. Okay, so the iron is actually back at the quarry smelting, so we're gonna have to go back and get that. Um, but I do, while we're here, I do we'll just wanna check with the Dinopedia and see how. Like, how this thing's doing well, because I do think... Oh my god, this is ridiculously spreading. But I do know that... Um, oh, I'm getting some of the max. That's good. Um, so we kind of have, like, a farm of them. But, oh my god, calm your butt down. Calm your hormones. Okay, where are you? Can I... Oh my god, he's beautiful. Come here. Uh, we have to name you. Triceratops, age zero, health, 12 hearts. Um, hunger is full. He's a herbivore. Temperament, uh, timid. He's a male, untamed. He's untamed. One or three round. I need a stick to do that. Yeah, Gariel. How do I tame him? Oh, okay. So he doesn't eat saplings. He does eat fern spores. Uh, he doesn't eat leaves, but he does eat a lot of this stuff from uh, biomes with plenty. So that's a big problem. How do I tame him? I think it's because I wasn't in the area. Shut up. Um. Possibly I may need to kill him and respawn him in I don't want to but if he if I can't tame him I don't really know. Um, let's just go over to the uh, quarry Let's teleport to the quarry and then oh, I hate that we keep falling down there quarry. That's a uh, backpack of oil um, Okay, so That stuff's being cooled down. That's making us a whole bunch of oil, but why is it gonna be pumped out? Oh, the thing's not going we do need a redstone torch for that Actually, I think a lever may work, because for some reason I don't have any redstone torches, but why... Okay, that's working. Why is that going so slow? I can't really see that, but why is it going so ridiculously slow? It was moving so much faster at one point. Maybe it's because I'm using coal. I don't know, but ooh, there's so much stuff in here. I hate how it's just, like, separating itself into all of them. Oh, that one's completely full of stuff. That is crazy. But so let's just teleport back to the dino park, and then, um... Also, I don't know if that's me, it's actual name, but for right now it is. But the problem is, I didn't really, I didn't really look up too much recently. I, I looked up this mod on the wiki a couple days ago, and I kind of forgot about it. Not about the mod, but like, I kind of forgot exactly what I looked up. So we're definitely going to have to try and look that up again, and hopefully see that we can tame it. Because if we can't, I'm going to have to kill him, and I'm just going to respawn him back in. Um, so he'll be tamed. And how did I craft this again? Oh, the bucket in the center. I'm like, I'm missing something here. Uh, feeder. But I really would rather not have to kill him, but sometimes, you know, you have to do things you don't really want to. So, feeder, that's meat. Uh, what's called? Does grass go in there? No. So, let's just put in the fern spores. Oh, it counts as, like, percentages? Very strange. But, okay. Um, let's take this little backpack. And then I think I can put the stuff in here from, like, behind. Yes, I can. Okay, good. Um, so, I'm going to see... I'm, oh my god, calm down. Actually, can I grow you with this? Oh god, I can. Oh god, that scared me. Um, can I tame you with, like, this? Oh my god, calm down. Where's the Dinopedia? Okay, so I do need a stick to command him, to, like, one him. And, oh! His health went up, like, four hearts, or something like that. Um, he's untamed. So, I'm thinking... Wait, did it just say how to tame him? No, okay. So, you know what? I am going to... I'm going to put this in here, and I'm going to currently... We should make a fern spore farm, but I'm going to check on the wiki and see... Oh my god, it's spraying like crazy. I'm going to check on the wiki and see how exactly we can tame him, if we can. Okay, so I did check on the wiki, and obviously I just took some screenshots, and hopefully that will probably be for the uh, 
the, uh, the, what is it called, the thumbnail for this video, but I did look it up, and if we miss our opportunity, fortunately we can tame him, but sadly we have to whip him, forcibly tame him, so, um, apparently you're only supposed to, oh god, I feel so bad about this, you're only really supposed to do it if he's at high, like, happiness level, and he is, because if he's not, then he will attack us, so let's just go get the sticks and the string, and oh, I feel so bad about this, I really, really do, but, but I have to tame him, because if he doesn't, apparently he'll, like, leave us or die or something like that. And I don't want that happening, so we're gonna have to do this. And also, while we're here, I do want to look... I forgot to look up of, like, behavior, like, play things or something like that, but I do know that there are certain things that we can use... Not use, but, like, put in his pen to make him happy. So there's a scratching post and a tethered log. I don't know exactly which one he would use. I don't think he'd use a scratching post, because he doesn't have exactly, like, claws, you know, he's, he's not like a, um... He's not like a Velociraptor or something like that. So let's just make a tethered log. So let's get some two more string. And then, you know, let's get the wood. I don't know where I'm walking more. Let's get the wood. And then let's just teleport. Oh, do I have wood on me? I do not. So let's get like a sack of jungle wood. And let's just teleport back because I do need to make strings and stuff. Actually, so before teleporting back, let's run up here and sleep first. Hi, Thorgy. Do you ever stop wagging your tail? Oh, he did stop. Um, it was so cute, I saw, like, they actually have, uh, when you came back, when we came back, you saw him sleeping. He was awake before, and he does actually have a sleeping motion, and it's just the cutest thing in the entire world of cute things. So I really hope that we can get that again, but he is awake, I can hear him, so let's just run back in here, and I feel really bad about this, I really do, but sometimes drastic measures, or drastic choices, whatever, it's, it's like, sometimes things are necessary, no matter how drastic, Jur <laughs> Jurassic, pun intended, well, actually, originally I didn't intend it, but it worked, but d no matter how Jurassic, 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 I can't talk right, um, no matter how Jurassic, I can't get Jurassic, like, Jurassic Park out of my head now, but no matter how Jurassic, sometimes certain things have to be done, oh my god, we need three string, don't we, yeah, we need three string, uh, I'll just go back to the house and get that in a moment. Um, so let's just keep running through here. And let's place this little tethered log here. I don't know exactly what this is going to do for him. Can I place it? Like, where do I place this? Do I place it just on the ground? I don't... I don't know what I do with this. Oh, maybe I need a scratch. Maybe it's like two pieces. I don't know anymore. Let's... We'll make one of these when we get back. So let's teleport back because we do need a uh, string can we forgot this we do need one more piece of string to make uh to make the what's it called the whip which i feel really bad about having to do but you know sometimes you have to do what you have to do and we have to do what we have to do in this situation um while we're here let's use this crafting table instead of the crafting table at the other place so let's just make this like so and then oh i feel so ridiculously bad about this i'm really sorry just ahead of time i'm really sorry for you guys that you have to deal with this and i'm really sorry for that the whole um that the triceratops has to deal with this but sometimes we have to do things that we don't want to do so let's just put this in here um wool and then a stick and then a slab i believe yes okay um and then let's run back not run back but teleport back to the dino park I think he's like screaming at us like, no, don't whip me. I'm sorry, Triceratops. We really have to name you. I don't really know what to name him. Oh, also, fun fact, I looked it up and the Triceratops was one of the first. Oh my god, this is over overkill. I looked it up and the, apparently the Triceratops was like the first. Shut up. I'm talking, so rude. Are like one of the first, or the first, in fact, uh dinosaur in the fossils and archaeology mod, so that's really exciting. Um oh god, that is huge. Um why can't I place this down then? Uh, I think it needs to be on like a wall or ceiling. Oh, ceiling. Oh god. Okay, so let's place this like right here maybe. I think that could be a good idea. And then let's, just in case he does want a scratching post, we could place it like right around here. Um, so let's whip him. I'm sorry, is he tamed? He's untamed. He's untamed. I didn't mean to fuck you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't. Stop. Don't. don't attack me. Stop it. Okay, fine. You kill me. You kill me. Because I think that means that you won't be aggressive to me anymore. I'm whipping you. Be mine. Tame. Is he not happy? I don't know why I couldn't tame him. Please don't tell me he's still trying to kill me. Okay, he's not. So, what's his happiness level at? Um, 
Main item stick. Wonder. Health. I'm not seeing his. Uh, his. His. Oh, he's age. He's one age now. That's nice. Um. Oh, the mood is 95. Okay, that's a high mood. I'm whipping him. I feel bad about this, but it doesn't seem to be hurting him, and nothing's actually happening. He's still untamed. Am I doing this wrong? Is this like a future thing, and right now it doesn't actually do anything? I feel bad that I keep having to whip him, but he's untamed, and it's not taming. Um, do you want food or something? I'm confused here. Why won't you be mine? Let's just look this up one last time. Maybe, maybe it's because he's one age, like he's one year old now, because I fed him the chicken, the, ens the essence of the chicken. I think we probably shouldn't have fed him that, because I think they can only be tamed at like a young age. I don't know. Let's just check this one last time, and hopefully we can actually tame him. Okay, so I looked at, no matter what time, not time, but no matter what age, we can still tame him. And apparently, if he's fully grown, we can actually ride on him with a saddle, so that'd be kind of cool. But apparently, every time I do this, his mood goes down, which I'm not really seeing it go down. But I'm also not seeing him be tamed. He's just standing here. Maybe I should re-log, and maybe it's like something's glitched out. Okay. Back in. Mood's still at 95, and he's still untamed. Maybe I need to command you with, with like a stick or something. Uh, I don't think I can actually use the stick because it's like he's not tamed yet. Maybe, oh, he just ate leaves from the ceiling. Okay. Uh, maybe it's because he's like, he was on a slab or something. So move back onto the grass. Let me tame you. I'm repeatedly right clicking. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening with the mood. It will not attack you. It's still untamed. Let's try growing it a little bit more. Please let me tame you. Pray, pray, please. Oh. Okay, well, we're gonna have to do this then. I'm really sorry. If you guys don't want to see this, look away from your screen. I, I, I beg of you, please look away. Oh my god, I hate this. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to. Oh my god, the cries. Oh god. Oh my god, that's awful. I feel so bad. It was my mistake though. We're gonna have to cheat in another egg. I can't believe that happened. Why couldn't you just be tamed and, and deal with it? Why'd you have to fight? I'm so sorry. Now which one is it? Oh, please don't tell me I have to kill this one too. So these are birds. Whatever these things are. Um. Oh, here it is. Oh, God. I'm so, so, so sorry. I promise. I didn't mean to. I'm really sorry. Okay, we're just gonna wait here until he hatches. And if it does take a little longer than expected, I'm just gonna skip to the moment of him hatching. Oh, God. I feel so bad. Oh, it moved. Is it gonna hatch? Um, I'm a little confused here. It did move. I saw it. Oh, it's moving! It's moving! Is it hatching? Is it hatching? Is it, it's dancing. Dancing egg. Is it, is it gonna hatch? I think it's gonna hatch. <clears throat> is it? <gasps> it hatched! De-extinction! Oh, a dinosaur egg has hatched. And now we actually own it. Yeah, I love the music that's playing. Is it actually tame though? It is. What is this music? It's beautiful. It kind of sounds like the Jurassic Park, but it's not. The de-extinction. I love it. Why is it going to stop playing? Oh, it stopped playing. Oh, I didn't mean to break that. I kind of didn't want it to stop playing. I love the music. It sounded great. So we don't have to whip it again, because I really don't want to. That was really bad, and I felt really bad about it the first time. So we're not going to do that. Um, <clears throat> back to everything. Oh, it's female this time. It's so male. Interesting. Okay, so it's really loud. But uh, let's use a stick. So stay. It, like, sits down. Oh, I love the animation. It gets back up for follow. Um, there's wonder. Let's just do wonder. So it can wander around in its little cage pen here. And, wow, this is so cool. So let's feed him. Well, actually her. Some essence of chicken. 
I better grab. Oh my god, what's attack me? How'd you get in here? Jerk. Oh my god, it will attack the the thing. Did I just hit you with the sword? I don't think so. It will actually attack the dinosaur. I mean, the dinosaur will actually attack it. That's really nice. But I want to know why. Oh my god, calm down. I'm so happy of yourself. Love how the tail's curling. <laughs> um, but I wonder why I actually got in here. Is it, like, where is it dark? I mean, it's possible that it just, like, fell in. But I don't really know. Um, it is turning nighttime. We do have a bed on us, so let's just sleep in the in this little pen for right now. Um, and I was thinking, while I was waiting for that little egg thing to hatch, there is, in the molasses door- Oh my god, calm down, you're so loud. In the molasses doors want- So basically, this door, it's a wooden door. It seems, like, really dainty and broken. Not broken, but it's, like, really- not sturdy and i don't really want to make an iron door um but i was thinking so in the molasses doors mod there's this thing that's like a factory door uh or maybe it's this thing uh, yeah laboratory door it's four iron and two gold and we have uh two iron on us we can just teleport back to the quarry get some more iron and stuff there and this is actually has a really nice animation and stuff of it opening and it's just really nice overall so let's just collect all of this is there any iron but there is iron in here um no iron in there there's like barely any iron in there um not seeing anything nothing nothing okay so let's just melt this we didn't actually get a whole lot of iron from this quarry but oh my you gotta be kidding me but we did get a decent amount not gonna lie so you know what we're going to do? oh seriously you know what we're going to do <clears throat> we are going to teleport back and we are going to um we are going to break this because this is pretty much done and over with we're going to break that quarry we're going to break all of this stuff the redstone engine the and the two combustion engines <clears throat> break all of it and we're going to oh we're getting a decent amount of fuel now it's nice we're gonna need to fill this up with oil again soon um so we're going to take that stuff like the engines and stuff and we are going to so we placed it it's 16 by 16 i believe i believe it only does like one chunk of stuff but i believe i do know how to make it bigger I, so i looked into the mod wiki a little bit and I, I was right we take these landmarks but it's just like a little bit different and this was just supposed to be a, a quick a, oh god don't fall back in there a quick thing a quick and easy fix uh to mine and stuff really fast and i want a, a big big quarry like in our like underneath our house or something like that Actually, that may be a bad idea because the house may collapse in. I don't really know about that. But I do want it, like, somewhere over there so that we have, like, this huge laboratory or something. But I do just want to have, like, another quarry or something here. So what we can do is we can just find the center, which is, like, right here, I believe. And we're just going to basically put another one here and just, like, continue this little mining bit here. So we can have, actually, let's break this block. Break that block. Let's get our torches. So we put the quarry up here engine torch and then we can put the redstone engine down there we can put the quarry right here there we go and then we can put all obviously our combustion engines here and here and then we'll just build like a little bridge leading over there and then obviously we need the uh the pipes oh okay I, that's not really gonna generate enough speed i was getting here i'm like oh no that's gonna start going without me but actually it's not because it, the redstone engines don't work for like the entire amount of speed um, so let's just build this little bit over. And, oh, there's lava there. So I think it does actually get stuck on lava. I know it goes through water, but I'm not too sure about lava. Um, also, I think it stops at oil, too. But, um, let's just build this little bit. And then let's just kind of extend this bridge over so we're hopefully not falling in. And, yes, there are two blocks on either side open. But, you know, who cares? That's fine. Um, not a huge deal. But we do need to extend these uh these pipes and stuff over so you know what let's just remove this i don't know why i'm using a sword where's my there it is i'm like where's my shovel um break this stuff away and i guess we can leave it there do we have i think we have more cobblestone pipes um either over here or back at the house no they're back at the house we can actually we can make some right now really easily just glass and uh actually we don't have a lot of cobblestone on us we do have cobblestone here though so let's just do glass and then cobblestone and cobblestone a whole bunch of cobblestone pipes almost a stack wow really really good um so we need the 
a wooden extraction pipe actually on this side so we need to break this and move <clears throat> that combustion engine over and then you know just move these transport pipes going over here and then yeah just continue this bit and oh no fix that did not mean to do that oh seriously oh god seriously oh, i hate this quicksand stuff oh you gotta be kidding me that's just not oh i hate you i think there may have actually been let's teleport to our death point because wrong death point um the this death point yeah, because it looked like, oh, there's a whole bunch of, oh my god, there's a bunny down here. How are you still alive? Oh, there's some redstone. Um, I just want to break this stuff and get this stuff and put it in the smelter. Well, put the iron, not the redstone, in the smelter. And then, uh, let's get these fossils. And is there anything else around here that the machine didn't get? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Why didn't it get this pillar? Oh, right, because there's the pots on the very top. That Oh, there's a permafrost in there. But that actually took up a whole lot of work that would have been really nice if we actually could have gotten. Oh, I think there's more of that, like, topaz stuff or something like that from the Bimes of Plenty mod up there. But we don't really need that. I don't really think that does anything for us. Because if I do remember correctly, the Bimes of Plenty mods, like the ores, not the ores, but, like, the gems, they don't actually do anything except make this, like, biome finder thing or something like that and make, like, uh, kind of decently interesting-looking blocks. Oh, this secret stone, seriously. And we don't really need that, but, you know, we could always try to make a biome finder or something like that eventually. Oh, I got a book from that. Interesting. Okay. So let's remove this death point and teleport. Uh, let's remove that. Actually, yeah. Um, teleport up here. And let's fix this whole thing, get that. And then let's just, you know, continue and connect these pipes up there and there. And that should be good and enough. I think all we need to add is the fuel buckets. So do we have any buckets? Oh, here they are. I'm like, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to have them. Um, and then let's just put one bucket of each in there. And then, you know, we'll get the oil and then put uh, these buckets in here. We're definitely need to make eventually all of this stuff like automatic, but that'll be for a future episode, video time thing not right now and also it seems like uh, we're out of coal in the sterling engines so we're definitely going to have to fix that um there we go all the buckets and hmm, i don't really want to use coal again oh no i have a whole bunch of coal in here never mind i'll just use the coal i'll split it i will split the coal like this and then split that and then put uh like split this and then split it again and that should be enough for now and is this going yet? The fuel's not... Oh, I'm like, why is it not going? It's because we need to put a redstone torch for it to go. Wow. Why is that red wool? That's going really quickly, but normally it's pipes. Oh, I guess it's like destruction blocks. This is interesting. That's going to actually go pretty quickly. Okay, good. Um, So let's just dump some of this stuff in here. The stuff that we do not need, like, at all. Um, And also stuff that matches this entire area. Oh, wait, no. We do get the glass bottles after feeding them to the, uh, the dinos. That's good. Um... Okay, so let's go back to Dino Park. And actually, I don't think I was meaning co to come back here. No, I was meaning to go back to the house because I need to get gold. Um, let's go home. Let's run down. Oh, also, I didn't. I don't remember if I ever told you about this. So I added the glowstone. When I was adding the glowstone, putting the glowstone in in the Dino Park, I had a whole bunch left over because I made way, I made way too much. So I just put them in the house. I kind of feel like this bit should have been over like here so it kind of matches up a little bit more but i do really really like it because it lights up the center of the room without having to have like torches on the floor and stuff and it just looks so much better than the torches but yeah so also um i fixed this little area i just made kind of look a little bit nicer um let's go get some gold i think we're actually running really low on gold we started off like with a stack a couple episodes a couple episodes ago can't talk right I don't know what happened to all of that, but, um, I'm, I want glass. We do have a whole bunch of sand, I believe. Uh, we have two stacks left of sand. Not the best, but, you know, have to do. Is there any, oh, nope. Is there any, uh, one that has a whole bunch of coal? This one, okay. Let's just put, can we smelt quicksand in the glass? No, we cannot. So let's just put the quicksand in this chest. And, um, we have that stuff going so we can get glass to make, um, these like glass sliding doors which i really really want to do because i think they'll look really cool for the um the balcony that we have over there so you know what let's just make our what am i doing we're making our factory doors first 
and let's make a laboratory door, not a factory door, sorry. The support to this place is right here. And then let's just uh, get our axe out, break down this wooden door. And let's just place this like right there. Oh, that wrong block needs to be placed. Oh god, that takes forever to break. Um, let's just place it. Oh, laggy. Right there. Why is it so, like, frame rate dropping? I don't know why I was doing that. Very strange. Very, very, very strange. Um, okay. I like how that looks. Very modern. Very, like, industrial looking. And I love, the, like, the, the, uh, the animation of it. Um, so are you eating? Uh, I think that's slower than it originally was. So, oh my god, let's break away some of this stuff. I think we're just going to break away all of these ferns, because if it does go, if, um, our Triceratops here, we have to name it, uh, but if, um, the Triceratops does go hungry, we can always, you know, um, we can always, like, it'll always eat all the other greenery and shrubbery in here, so that's fine, but I do just want to break all this, because we can always plant, um, plant more under a tree closer to our house and have, like, a farm of ferns or something like that. Is it all of them? I think so. Okay. So let's just put all of these in here. But let's just, like, leave a couple. Um, oh, no. I didn't mean to do that. Let's just put three there. Put the rest in. And then let's feed this guy some more essence of chicken. Have it grow a little bit more. Um, oh, God. It's sleeping now. Oh, God. That's huge. Okay. that's. I think that's its full max health. But look at, the, like, the whatever on its back. Like spikes and, oh, my God. The horns. Everything's huge now. Hello, baby, boo-boo. I didn't mean to punch you. I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. Please don't attack me. The, the health is really low. Is I think it may be hungry. Uh, yeah, it's really hungry. I guess because I just, I just like, not leveled it up. I just, I put, like, a lot of health into it, I guess. Um, female, just put plays. Wonder, stick, uh, activity, journal. I don't know what that means. It says active, it's active during the day. So it's, oh, it's, like, nocturnal journal i don't know that's like day night cycle i like that okay so it's six years old or six days old i don't really know but it has like the size of six days old i think i think that's what it means i don't really know um i can feed you while you're sleeping and standing up i love the z's coming out of it so cute oh i didn't mean to feed you all of it but you know that's fine um oh my god look at its eyes it's beautiful i also i, I love oh i want to take oh my god oh my god it just broke, like, everything. All of the green shrubbery there. I think it's trying to escape from me. Oh, it's playing with the stuff. That's so cute. I love it. Aww. We have to name it. So, it is a female. Um, it is... Well, we did name our horse Cookies and Cream. We could name this one Chocolate. Rocky Road. I don't really know what Rocky Road looks like. I don't really eat Rocky Road. But it does kind of look like Rocky stuff on the back. So, let's name it Rocky. We're rocking. No, let's just go like full ice cream, full on ice cream flavor. So let's get out of this place and let's get a sign. Let's make a sign and let's name it Rocky Road. Um, I think that's a really good name for it. I'm, we may change it eventually. Don't really know, but I think I think that's a really really good name for it. And actually, while we're doing this, we probably should make. Um, well, we should probably get another set of signs and stuff, and make. Let's make two chests. So, I don't know if Sean or Shauna, whatever her name is, is dead or not. So, we're basically going to be burying an empty casket. Um, but first, let's just... Where should we put the sign? Maybe, like, right here. Um, let's do Rocky Road. Is Rocky Road one or two words? I think it's two words. Rocky Road, um, EP, which is episode point, I, I believe, 17? No. No, no, it's 19, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, today's episode 19. And then when this guy dies, if he ever does die, I mean, she, if she ever does die, we'll just do, like, 19 dash, then the other episode name, um, or the number, sorry, and we'll just put that there. This is really cool. I, I say ghoul, as in, like, cool and good mixed together. I really don't know why, but regret it. I definitely do. So it is daytime, I mean, nighttime, so I really don't want to die from, like, something killing me like zombies or skeletons so i want to hurry this up but i don't know exactly where to put the graves i don't want to put it too close to the house because i kind of feel like it's going to haunt me or something like that but i don't want to put it too far away and i don't want to really mar uh not marry her dare i can't talk right bury her into the village like a graveyard and stuff because that's already really full of capacity and stuff it's full of dead bodies <laughs> um like graveyard should be but um yeah it's full of of like space and stuff there's no real space 
like, left to bury her. And also, I, she wasn't just, oh, God. It's a horde of animals. Not animals, mobs. But, um, yeah, this is really bad. Um, why is it, like, not laggy? It's, like, spotty again. Okay, it fixed itself. Okay, but as I was saying was, um, I don't... How? 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 How did it just... What in the... What? Well, let's just... We're just gonna teleport home. We're gonna sleep. Because that thing just jumped over the fence. And I'm scared. But I don't really want to bury her in the village. Because I feel like there's no grave spots left. For another another body. And another um, like grave area. Also, we need two gravel pieces. To like put on top. So let's go get some gravel. So I don't really know exactly where we should put her. Oh, also, let's get some flowers. Because that's what we did for Fiji's grave. <gasps> Fiji's grave was where he died. That's where we put Fiji's grave. We could put her grave, like, where she disappeared, something like that, by our house. But I don't really know I want to do that. I don't really know her favorite flowers and what those were. So I'm just going to use a whole bunch of flowers. Um, These are mostly blue. I want, like, blue, purple, and kind of controversial colors. So not orange. Uh, let's just do these yellow ones. They're kind of really nice looking. Um... So now let's teleport. Let's let's just search on the map. So we have our house. Let's do it daytime. We have our why is that not working? Okay. So we have our house here. Animal pen. You know, I can't really do it on the map. It doesn't really work. So let's just jump out up here. Where am I going? I'm going crazy, that's what I'm doing. Um so let's just run. We could have it Seriously? Seriously, where's my sword? Oh god, I wonder if I can whip the creeper. You seriously I backed up far enough. So rude. So rude. God, what's this young people never having patience today? It just killed yourself, creeper. Hate you. Um, I'll fix this stuff later, but we could have it somewhere up here. Because we're gonna eventually extend that path. We could have we could have like a nice little memorial area up on the top of this hill. Yeah, I like that idea. So let's just get our axe. Where's our axe? Oh, I'm an idiot. It's in our it's in our hopper already. So let's just knock down and chop down a couple of these trees. And I love this timber mod. I will never take the, well, I'm already taking this thing for grain, kind of. Um, I'm using it so much, because you just break the bottom block of and everything. The entire tree trunk goes flying down, and I love it so much. It's so easy and fast. Um, I don't want to break it away too much, because I don't really want to make it seem obvious. Oh, I, my inventory's out of space. But I don't want to make it seem obvious that there's anything up there, because I don't want people like disrupting the graves. I say graves, plural, because I know someone else is going to die, whether it's an animal or a person. I don't really know, but I know eventually it's going to happen. So let's just, you know what? This is a really good spot because then you get a nice look of the house and the animal pens and you get a good look of like that entire area. And it's kind of the center of our world, not the island. But I think it's really, really good. Um, What's that? Oh, I think that's, I think that's uh, Thorgy. Okay, so... I will eventually um, clean up all of these blocks and stuff and, and add like a proper path coming up here. But for right now, let's just dig some of this stuff away. And the path would be coming up like that. So it'd be around here. Then it'd turn and come up here. So I think the first one should be around over like around this area over here. Um, you know what? We could dig away this layer. I think it'd make our life so much easier instead of trying to build it up. So let's just dig a little bit of this stuff away. And I will fix it in between videos, like off camera. It's not a huge deal. Um, but yeah, let's just dig some of this stuff away. And collect all that dirt and stuff up. And just smooth this area out a little bit. Um, something like that kind of could look nice. And then, you know, let's just, let's just put first grave of... Hopefully not many, but chances are it's going to be a decent amount. First grave right there. Nice gravestone. Um, actually, let's break that. I have an idea. We, put, we could put the grave up on, like, a block of cobblestone. And then you, we could have the grave on top of that so we can put the actual sign, like, right here. I think that could work. Um, so let's do R, R, I, P. Um, I don't really remember how to spell her name. I think it was, like, that. No, that. Um, Sean. She lasted from... Oh, what episodes? Actually, let's move this up one block. Not one block. One, like, level. 
Can I, how do I do that? How do I go backspace? Apparently I can't, so let's restart that. Uh, we're gonna do RIP at the very top. Dot P, uh, I, dot P dot, and then we're going to do um, RIP, then her name, and then we're going to do the EP. She lasted from episode uh, 19, 18, 17, I believe. I will change that if it's wrong, 17 to uh, 19. Actually, 18, because I can't find her in this one. Lasted two episodes. That's really, really bad. Um, and then, let's just do a little thing. I don't... I don't know. Oh, no. Let's just do... Let's just do... Still missing. Still missing. Because that's all I can fit in there. Oh, that's sad. Um, yeah, I feel really bad about that one. Okay, so this is very... Very good. We did a decent amount in today's episode. We got the whole thing with the Triceratops done. And the whole grave thing. I don't actually know how long the episode actually is. Because I recorded a whole bunch of footage that I know I'm not going to put up on the final product of the video. I'm just going to edit it out. So I don't know exactly how long this thing is going to be. But we have been recording for about an hour and a half. So I think that's really good time to end this off. Um, but yeah guys, if you like this video leave a like on it and share it to your friends because it really does help me out and oh really big i think we may need to extend the cage i don't know though um kind of regret giving you all that chicken of essence essence of chicken thing but yeah guys if you watched it all the way through thank you so much for watching and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because once again it does really help me out and i will see you in the next one bye guys